Hi everyone, welcome to Moon Garden. My name is Abigail and today I'm doing my very first vlog for Vlogtober. Okay, so it's very late. It is a quarter till 11 and I'll be making a soup from this cookbook, which is so beautiful. And I have not made this particular recipe before. It is an apple and butternut squash soup. And it just looks very, very wholesome. And then tomorrow I'll be going to a vintage festival. And well, my friend who's coming with me, Holly, uh, we will have flasks of soup and it will be divine. Don't really like cutting this late at night, but I'm sure it will be worth it. Okay, it is now 12.21 in the morning. October 7th and I need to be awake in six and a half hours. I'm going for this one. So pretty and it still works. These aren't vintage but I've always loved French soaps in the square so I may have to get something to take home. I quite like this pink candlestick holder so Putting it on my list, if I haven't forgotten about it in a while, I'll come back for it. So beautiful. I just like all these old white items. Mmm, it smells good. Mmm. <laughs> I'll, I'll fix that later. <laughs> so we realized in returning to the car that we parked by the most amazing home. Pink. What's the verdict? Oh, it's very good. Woo! Very, very good. so much I wish I could get, but I will try very hard to have self-control and I hope you don't mind admiring things with me. <coughs> Isn't that beautiful? I feel like that's my phrase of the day. How do I look after six hours of sleep. <laughs> Gonna think about this tray. That's a pretty good price. And I love anything black with florals. This is a very, very colorful booth. My goodness. I don't know if this is 1940s. What some of this stuff is. Salt and pepper. I wonder how this person finds their items if it's estate sales or they just have an eye for color. For anyone that likes kitchen memorabilia, this is a, there's a lot to feast your eyes on. These tins are pretty timeless. I haven't seen any like this though, even though I said that they're timeless. How cute. These are so cute. I don't know how practical, but I'll have to think about these. Just got a recipe holder, but this one um, I'm drawn to as well, so. I love this idea to line a shelf with paper. So I'm just taking a lot of inspiration. This is also a cute idea of how to store some of these more pamphlet-like old um, recipe cookbooks and then I'm just taking everything in. To be honest, I'm getting quite overwhelmed with the amount of things. And I'm actually not buying a lot, but I just feel like all the imagery is doing something for me. This booth is really feminine in a way that I quite 
feel at home. <laughs> we are so done and we're eating at Whole Foods and thank you for going on this journey with us and we will bid you adieu until next time.